All right, everyone. Welcome back to Call of Duty: uh, Modern Warfare. Now, this video is much like the one I made on the 725. I am grinding for camos, for the gold camos, on certain weapons. The M4 being one of them. And with the M4, I was having trouble um, with the long shots, so I wanted to gunsmith just like I did with the 725, and did everything I could to increase damage and range on it. And I kind of wanted to show you guys the result. By the way, that time that I just died is the only time I died this whole match. Um, but with the attachments that I have on it, which I will show at the end of the video, again, like I did last time, it makes this thing an absolute laser from range. You saw right there. That wasn't a long shot, but it still is a laser from range. Um, the one place where the M4 struggles is is at long distances, like a really long distances, like long shot distances, which is what you need for the camo. Um, it tends to not be as strong. Right there, I got a long shot. It tends to not be as strong at those long distances and takes a lot more shots to get kills and it's a lot harder to get long shots. Um, so, I, and I was having trouble with long shots. So I, I went in and I figured out, okay, let me, let me put everything I can to make the range increase on this thing and see if I can make it a, a laser from distance so I can get some long shots. So I did and it did. Uh, this, it makes this a laser from pretty much any distance. Now, I, um, uh, w with the M4, I, I, again, I don't tend to use. I haven't used it a lot, so I don't have a lot of stuff unlocked for it. Um, but the things that I have unlocked for it, and I put on it, make this this thing is a laser beam. Um, it, it really is. Uh, from any range, this isn't just like a short range, like a long range thing. We're now like at short range, still the same, but at the distance is no. Like it's really good any range. I hear this guy coming from my left, by the way, in a second. That's why I'm about to turn and shoot over there. But, um, uh, I uh, yeah I. It, it, it just shreds now at like any distance, any range. Um, it was already really good. Short to medium range was really, really good already. It was very strong. Um, and which is why it's one of the best guns in the game. But it was the weakness it had was the long range. But with this class and with these attachments, it, it negates that weakness. It makes it just as strong at range as it is pretty much everywhere else, except for those extreme long ranges that you get in like Ground War or in those like. Because you have those long, extended, gigantic maps, that's different. But for like most maps, pretty much at any range, you'll be able to get consistent, efficient kills with this, uh, with these attachments. And like, and so for me, like the the reason I did it was because I was struggling with long shots, just like I was with the 725. Um, and so I, I had like I think 17 long shots with this gun before I put these attachments. And since I put it, I played two matches. And I've gone from 17 long shots up to, I think, like 30 something, 31 or 32. I've had 15 long shots in two games after having 17 in like hours of gameplay. Um, because it, the, the, the one weakness it has, like I said, I put this over mid like I always do. The one weakness that this thing has is the range. So it was, I was having a lot of trouble with, the, with those long shots until I put this class on. So I, I kind of wanted to show you guys um, the. Just like to give to help, right? Because I know that I'm not the only one who's trying to get the gold camels. Ignore my accuracy there, that was awful. I don't want to talk about it. But I'm not the only one trying to get these gold camels. And if you're having trouble with the long shot, this is a really good way of doing it. Again, my accuracy was garbage. There it is. Finally, got to actually kill somebody. My veto actually got somebody too. So I'm getting triple kills, double kills, quad kills. But the fact of the matter is, um,. I was really having a lot of trouble. I also recommend if you're if you are grinding for camels, I recommend highly that you do shoot house 24/7 because it's the easiest. You just encounter so many people so often that it's the easiest way to just grind those camels out um, the quickest. Um, so I, um, yeah, I, this gun now is even better than it was before, and I'm enjoying using it a lot. Just like I enjoyed using the 725 when I put all those attachments on it as well. Um, I don't know how much I'm gonna use them because, like I said, I'm not one to use same weapons over and over and over and over again um, and I still have a lot more weapons that I have to um, that I have to grind gold for so I have to finish the M4 I finished the 725 I got the gold camel the 725 I have to do, still finish the M4 which I'm not far from I should be done very soon um, I have to still do the MP5 and I have to do the HDR and I still have to do the PKM so I still have a lot of grinding to do but the doing things like this where like I can find certain ways to make it a lot more efficient it the more times I can do that, the better, because it's a lot harder. Um, it, like it's a long grind, so the the more I can shrink that long grind and make it a shorter grind, the better. Um, so here I got my chopper gunner. I'm gonna just destroy. Uh, this guy's trying to come around to where I am, so I'm kind of like protecting myself. 
Um, also, in the last video, I, I don't know why, but I, I thought the yellow box meant something different, and I ended up shooting myself with the chopper gunner, which is actually hilarious. I didn't even notice that until post. Um, but, yeah, I, I just I highly recommend you try this class out um, if you're having trouble with the long shots with the N4. It really helped me out tremendously on being efficient, uh, more efficient with the long shots and getting a lot more than every match. Um, so I highly recommend you try it out. I will show you guys everything that I have on it. I can go um, attachment by attachment to let you guys see what it is that you need to do to get long shots with the M4. So uh, yeah, let's check that out. Okay, so let me show you guys exactly what I have on my M4 that increases damage, it increases the range, and makes the long shots just that much easier when you're trying to gr grind for the gold camos. Um, because as strong as the M4 is, as I said previously um the the place where it struggles is in those real long range fights where you would get long shots um because long shots are relative to the gun type right so shotgun long shots are gonna be shorter than ars which are gonna be shorter than snipers and so on and so forth so the the way you in order to get long shots with this gun more efficiently this is the easiest way in my opinion It's the best class to do it with plus it makes this gun really good overall anyway so i'm probably gonna just stick to this class anyway um, so I have the monolithic suppressor, which increases sound suppression, uh, which isn't a big deal, but it increases damage range, which is a big deal. So you see the 8 down side speed and aim walking steadiness do drop because of that, but it's worth it. I have the marksman, the Corvus custom marksman right, uh, barrel on it, which increases damage range, bullet velocity and recoil control, the ADS speed and the movement speed drop. Um, but that's what you kind of have to sacrifice for the range. Any sight doesn't really matter. I have the M16 stock. This one helps the aiming stability, so you don't have as much recoil. Again, it drops the aim walking movement speed, so a little mobility drop there. And then I have to run full metal jacket. These five attachments make this gun disgustingly good at distance. Um, I, I tried to, I tried other stuff. I didn't really like the way it was performing with the other things. This is the one that I found that was the most consistent and the best. It makes this gun absolutely disgusting, as you saw in that last game. Um, and it, it, if you guys are having trouble with long shots, I really highly recommend you try these out. Uh, maybe it's not for you, but I highly recommend you at least try it out because it, it really helped me a lot in getting the long shots for this gun. I'm not fully done with the long shots yet, but I'm getting them at a lot, a lot, a lot higher clip than I was before. Um, I was really struggling with the long shots. I think I played like 10 games and I got like two long shots the whole time. And in the last two games since I've been using this, I've gotten like almost 20 long shots. So it really, really helps. Um... But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the content. Um, if you did, please make sure to drop a like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next one.